Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I am here with a channeled messages reading from your person for all of my cancers who are watching. So if you have cancer as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So cancer, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get into your reading, Cancer, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Cancer, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. All right, Cancer, <clears throat> excuse me, let's go ahead and get into your reading. First, we're going to pull some Situations Oracle cards. We'll go ahead and check in on the energy and the themes that we have coming towards you in regards to love. You could also be dealing with this energy currently. So let's pull a few cards for Cancer, please. What energy do we have coming towards Cancer at this time? What energy does Cancer need to be aware of when it comes to love and their person? First card that we have is interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page. Go ahead and get another card, please, for Cancer to match this energy. What else do we need to know here when it comes to love for Cancer with this interview card? We also have insatiable, unquenchable, wanting more. Can we please have one more card for Cancer? And that card is legal, court paperwork filed. Let's just see what we have at the bottom of the deck. We also have Archangel Michael, protection prevented from harm, divine intervention. We also have negotiator, bargaining, begging. And then we'll just look at one more cancer. We also have happiness. Wholeness, overjoyed, smiling. All right, so to get started, the first few cards we have, interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page, insatiable, unquenchable, wanting more, and legal, court paperwork filed. So, of course, Cancer, not everything has to resonate for you. Only take what resonates out of this reading, please, but... I feel like for some of my cancers out there, it's like you want more from this person and from this connection, but at the same time, you feel like you should stay away or something has come in the middle of this connection that causes for you to stay away. And also with that Archangel Michael card, it showed protection prevented from harm and divine intervention maybe this connection is not working out for the best um, there might be a lot more behind the scenes that you don't really know about you might have some insight towards but as far as the full extent of the situation or what is happening behind the scenes it's it's better to leave you out of it cancer so we do have the legal card, court paperwork filed. This might be very specific for some of my cancers out there. Maybe there is something legally that's going on. Um, but I feel like if there is a factor that is coming in the middle of this connection, it's prohibited or it's prohibiting you two from coming closer together for a reason because it has to be that way. And also... With that Archangel Michael card, maybe you're being rerouted or this 
this connection isn't happening as smoothly for a specific divi divine reason. So we have the legal card, but it's like you, you want more from this connection. We have insatiable, unquenchable wanting more. Maybe things between you and this person, you were very optimistic about it because of how things were, because of how things started off and how they were transitioning. And then all of a sudden, that's when this interference came, came into play. So it's like, you may feel like there's, there's still more to come out of this connection. And that's completely natural. And also just, just being eager to get things started with this person. So I, I feel like you want to resume this as, as fast as possible, but there's a barrier in the middle here. We do have interview, talk, conversation, get on the same page. I feel like this is what you want with this person to get on the same page with them. But this could be a energy that is coming towards you. Maybe you and this person are coming together to, to meet in the middle, to get on the same page and maybe clear up any any confusion or any tension here. But let's get some specific messages to see what else we need to know here. Can we please get a few cards for Cancer, please, when it comes to this person and their energy? What do we need to know here for Cancer? And I do want to apologize, Cancer, if the audio sounds a bit differently. I misplaced my usual microphone, so I'm using a different one. I don't really prefer it as much, but I did want to put this reading out there um, for you all. So I hope the audio sounds good enough. I'll go ahead and listen back to it after I complete the reading as well. But <clears throat> we have three cards to begin with, Cancer. Let's get three more, please, for Cancer here. What else do we need to know? Guarding this person and their energy, please. Let's get another card for Cancer. We'll take this card. Let's go ahead and get two more specific messages, please, for Cancer. Let's get one more card. All right, Cancer. So once again, um, not everything has to resonate for you out of this reading. Please only take what resonates let's get into these cards we have there's no one else like you your energy is irreplaceable we have you will hear from me soon this isn't over i want to know everything there is about you your mystery to me i'm a work in progress i'm trying to be better there's so much curiosity i have when it comes to you and you've changed my perspective so Cancer, I feel like the energy that we do have or that I just went through, it it applies to the energy we have now. Um, I feel like for some of my Cancers out there, the energy between you and this person is you two got things started as far as getting to know one another, maybe recognizing that there's this spark between you two. And it was like, it was natural, it was effortless, but then all of a sudden or out of nowhere, this person kind of backed off and they distanced themselves. And it, it's like they just, yeah, they left this connection without any explanation and that has you thinking or wondering what's next to come or is that is that it? Is this all finished? Like, I, I feel like you're somewhat looking for closure here, but at the same time, you feel like this person might resurface or they might pop back up because things were going so great between you two. And I feel like this might be fairly new as far as you really knowing this person, Cancer. You two could definitely have history with one another, but I do feel like this is a person that you don't know completely. And if that is the case, I, I do feel like maybe this legal card court paperwork file that might resonate with with them personally or what they have going on um but I I feel like there is a lot more behind the scenes that you don't really know about cancer so this person may have not given you or gave you any insight towards what they have going on on their end individually so let's go ahead and get into these cards. We do have, I am a work in progress. I'm trying to be better. I feel like this is this person's energy to you, Cancer. 
And if they did leave this connection or they didn't really, like, they dropped their energy, they didn't really give you an explanation or any hints or clues, I feel like it was nothing about you, Cancer. It was just what they had going on on the back end here. So I'm a work in tro- or excuse me, I'm a work in progress. I'm trying to be better. I feel like that's their energy, Cancer. And maybe they were not expecting to have a connection with you as strong as they felt it to be, or maybe they they needed time to get everything together because, of course, involving someone in your life closely, it sometimes calls for accommodating or rearranging things or at least giving that person the time and consideration that is required. So, yeah, this person could be fixing things up together for themselves so that they could be a better partner to you or just make more more availability in their life for you cancer so i'm a work in progress i'm trying to be better we have i want to know everything there is about you your mystery to me as well as there's so much curiosity i have when it comes to you so these two specific messages i do feel like these these messages are your energy cancer because it's like you two may have had a strong connection from the start but because they pulled away their energy you you really don't know what to think of them right now or at all maybe it's making you reconsider who they are or question who they are um but i i feel like your your thoughts as or your thoughts pertaining to this person um they might be wandering because it's like you got to know this person for a short amount of time and then they pull away their energy and like I said before, you don't know if this is over, if this was their plan to begin with. Um, so I feel like you're genuinely curious about what this person is doing, what they have going on right now, and also the whole point of them getting to know you and sharing their energy with you. So we also have, there's so much curiosity I have when it comes to you. I, I feel like this is your energy cancer. We have, there's no one else like you. Your energy is irreplaceable. This is a message for you, Cancer. Um, I'll get into these other cards, but I feel like this is how this person feels about you, Cancer. I feel like their intention, like obviously they know if this has been resonating with you, they know how they left things, but I feel like their intention was not to strike you or hurt you, Cancer. I, I feel like they were getting things together for themselves and in their mind they they knew that this wasn't over you will hear from me soon this isn't over they knew that they were going to come back and resume this and this is a reason why because of who you are and your energy cancer and I did touch on this briefly but it could like if this person was not expecting to meet someone like you and then all of a sudden they knew that they had to straighten things up they needed to get things together for themselves in order to really maintain and handle a connection like this or the type of quality of connection that they wanted with you that might excuse their absence here and we have you've changed my perspective i feel like this is also their message to you cancer just them re reconsidering things um wanting to get things together quicker so that they could be ready for you Maybe as far as love as well, um, maybe they they weren't intending on jumping into something serious or taking someone seriously, but when it comes to you, Cancer, they find you worth it. So let's just get a few more specific messages for Cancer, please. What else do we need to know here for Cancer? What else is coming towards Cancer when it comes to love, please? get one more card okay so we have three cards and then one also fell cancer so let's see what we have we have i'm strong on what i will not tolerate my way or the highway i can't deal with this silence any longer and i will always hope for another chance with you 
So for some of my cancers out there, this could be a person from the past, someone that you did have that same spark with initially. It was like a strong connection here and you were all for it. You were optimistic. You wanted this to work out, but I feel like this person may have really disrespected you and just ignoring you or even walking away in the way that they did because you were giving your love to this person open, openly and generously. And this person, it was like they, they could care less. So we do have, I'm strong on what I will not tolerate. I feel like if you were disrespected here, Cancer, this is your energy um, because it's, it's best to save your emotions as soon as possible if you if you feel like they're going to be wasted or not reciprocated or taken for granted so you may have walked away from this connection when you felt like you were falling in too deep with no no safety net from this person so someone not making you feel comfortable making you feel like you're you're putting out your love for nothing they could have been stubborn if they were acting that way towards you cancer we have my way or the highway maybe they were just not an easy person to really communicate with or deal with or this energy is also kind of giving like emotionally unavailable to an extent so if you did walk away from this person cancer you maybe did that because with this my way or the highway card you knew that there was no solution or a way to get through to them like they were just stubborn they wouldn't take the time to hear you out and like, it was like you were dealing with a brick wall. And I, I feel like if that's the case for you, Cancer, they lost your energy. I will always hope for another chance with you. They know exactly what they missed out on. But they, they really hurt you. But I feel like I can't deal with this silence any longer. That's also their energy here. Wanting to come back and try to pave a way um, so you two can get on the same page with one another instead of them always wondering about what could have been with you. Let's see what sign you might be dealing with cancer. Can we please get a sign for cancer? Capricorn. Sagittarius. Let's get one more sign, please. For cancer and Aries. All right, Cancer, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.